Hey friends, Amy here. Today I'm gonna to be sharing some music and a story that I think is pretty interesting. A lifetime ago, for a hot second, I was involved with an America's Cup sailing team and I learned a song that I really love from some Aussie sailors. I think a lot of you know it, it's called Waltzing Matilda. I'm not gonna to try to sing it, I'm gonna play it for you on flute in a little bit, but the lyrics are, once a jolly swag man, camped by a billabong underneath the shade of a coolaba tree and he sang and he watched and waited while his billy boiled you'll go a waltzing matilda with me and for me this has always been a really happy drunken sailor song about a jolly swag man i guess it didn't even cross my mind that i don't know what a swag man is i assumed it was what we would call a highwayman and that he was in love with this woman named Matilda and they went waltzing together and had fun. But I learned from one of my favorite young musicians, a Brisbane-born violinist by the name of Ray Chen, that the song doesn't mean what I thought it meant at all. The most interesting thing that I learned is that a Matilda to Aussies is what we would call a bindle stiff. It is the bundle that a hobo carries on the end of a stick, which was cool for me because I work with Bindlesta Family Circus After School. And that to go waltzing a Matilda means to become a hobo. For a really wonderful recording, Google search Ray Chen, Waltzing Matilda, and my favorite performances that he did uh, were the ones the encore performances with the Chicago Symphony Orchestra uh, or with uh, LA. So now I'll play that for you on the flute. Waltzing Matilda was not originally written for the flute. It's a piece of folk music that may have descended from a Scottish folk song, which means that it may have been written for an instrument uh, more like one of these. This is a fife. This is actually a reproduction American Civil War era fife. Uh, or it may have been played on one of these, which may be closer to a Scottish fife. Both of these were made by a lovely company in Enfield, Connecticut, Sweetheart Flutes. Uh, I believe that the maker is retired though, so I feel really lucky to have these. I'm not going to play Waltzing Matilda for you on these today, even though it would sound more genuine. Right now, um, I'm having a whistle a chromatic penny whistle, made for me uh, by an incredible company called O'Brien Whistles and it's on its way from Canada. So I hope when that arrives, I'll be able to share that with you and get a more authentic sound for the song than the flute gives. And I have one more act in the works for this song that I hope will get to premiere sometime in June or July, but I'm gonna hold that as a secret. Thanks for joining me. <laughs>